Mr. President, as you know, the Irish people are deeply troubled about the catastrophe that's unfolding before our eyes in Gaza. And when I travel the world, leaders often ask me why the Irish have such empathy for the Palestinian people. And the answer is simple. We see our history in their eyes, a story of displacement, of dispossession, a national identity questioned and denied, forced emigration, discrimination, and now hunger. Mr. President, we also see Israel's history reflected in our eyes, a diaspora whose heart never left home, no matter how many generations passed, a nation state that was reborn and a language revived. I believe it's possible to be for Israel and for Palestine, and I believe you do too.